everyone! I recently attended the third annual U Camp Trailer Rally put on by New Camp, and I found this to be a great opportunity to walk around and ask a whole bunch of campers what their favorite camping accessory was. So, in no particular order, here are some great items to add to your camping pack list. Hi, I'm Elaine, and this is Don and my favorite thing for the camper. It is a Coleman Point Loma Dome. This is its maiden voyage and it has held up through two, thun three thunderstorms. And as you can see, it fits perfectly over the back of the clamshell, over the tent of the kitchen, so everything stays dry. Hello there, my name is Dawn. I'm just showing you this fantastic table that we saw the other day at one of our fellow tagger sites. It's a great table, it's lightweight, it uh, comes apart very easily, unclip it, take it apart, fold it up, your table fold, your legs fold up, all together in a neat little bag. So one of the things I liked uh, or found that I liked using my tank because there's so little space is these little buckets because we got no gray water tank. This is what they look like when folded up and they fit underneath this yeah, bed inside just nice. So we, with these campers you gotta worry about storage and this is a great thing when you're on the go. If you're thinking about looking for a good organizational tool for your bathroom, I would recommend these containers. They're called Smart Store, and I purchased them at the Container Store. And you can either get one container or divided containers for the inside. And the best part is it keeps you organized in your Tab 400 bathroom. And plus, when you go underway, you just place it back into the shelf, and it locks down, and it's ready to go, and you don't have to repackage everything. So uh, back at the container store, I found this product and I think it's great. You can cut it to fit and you can easily place it into your kitchen sink and then that way you don't have a problem with your sink scratching or staining. So a perfect solution. If you're looking for a good option for cleaning, uh, there's a product made by Norwex, which stands for Norwegian Experience, and they make these anti-back towels. So you basically can clean with just water. So it, you don't have to worry about toxic chemicals, and they also make these in bath towels, which dry very quickly. And you know when you're camping, that's the hardest thing is to get your bath towels to dry out when it's a rainy day. This is our latest find. When in Sugar Creek, you've got to visit Lehman's Hardware. Biggest hardware store anywhere. It's a great little enamel teapot. What's wonderful about it is that it will boil water. The smaller base allows the water to heat more quickly and efficiently. It matches the wonderful red stripes on our tag. And because of the low profile, you can leave it on the burner when you close the hatch and it doesn't cause any problems. And it was incredibly affordable. So it's cute, it works, and it, we love it. Hey, this is one of my favorite mods. I got this at Bed Bath & Beyond for $20 and it is compactable. It's inflatable and deflatable. You can throw it in your camper and it takes no extra weight and it's cheap. This is the best thing since sliced bread. If you eat bread. I'm gluten free. I don't do that anymore. Anyway, um, inside if you're a K-cup coffee user, this is a a K-cup French press and the K-cups live inside this part of it. You take your K-cup out, you put it here. This guy, which is your measure, you can measure how much coffee you want. I like lots of coffee. You put that on, you pour your water in boiling. You can either microwave it or boil it on the propane stove and you can already smell it. See, it's even cold water. And then you press down. There you go. All done, no mess, throw it away. Voila. One of my favorite mods is this organizer. I use three command strips at the top to hold everything. I got this for $14.99 at Home Goods. And it's awesome to organize everything. When I drive, when we're on the road, I just lift this off and take it and lay it on the bed. And it works fantastic. I have this uh, battery powered light as a little uh, additional feature, which is real nice. It's magnetic. Uh, the newer ones have a little dimmer switch on them so you can dim it out, but it, it comes in very handy at night. 
So we, we added the waist safe hitch. Um, it allows you to get your tongue weight, help, help balance the load when you're uh, getting ready to take off. You can be, you can find these at Amazon or from waysafe.com. My favorite camping accessory is my ice machine. Cocktails are better with good ice. Hi, so the little gadget that I have for you that I have in my trailer, my Tab 400, is the Accurate Temperature sensors. It has two sensors with the device. One goes in your refrigerator and it has a second one for the display for your freezer. So I have the one in the fridge right now. The second one in the for the freezer, I used to sometimes put that in my cooler. So if I want to know the temperature of my cooler, I could read my temperature in my cooler. Uh, my favorite camping thing is the Camp Chef Sherpa. It folds up, legs fold up, metal table goes in the case behind it, and you can open up and you can store pots and pans and dishes, accessories, canned goods, whatever you want in there. This is one of my favorite uh, camping accessories. I was a tent camper, so I just started doing this. But this is by Ozark Trails, and it's just a sidewall, but it has all these pockets. And it's great because I can just put my paper towels here. You can put things you need to grab right away, handy wipes, bug spray. And then this down here is where you would put a trash bag. But we're closing up camp, so we're getting ready to put it down. It's multi-purpose. It's not that expensive. You can pick it up in the Walmart store, in the camping section. I just ordered mine online. So these carpet squares are sold everywhere. Walmart, Target, any place, your RV dealership. And they just wrap around your step. And they've got little spring hooks that you can hook them in and uh, attach it to it. Um, you can't travel with it. You have to remove it for travel. But it goes on and it collects a lot of dirt. It also makes this a lot less slippery, which is awesome. One of the problems we have in here, sometimes this gets a little warm and we don't want to run the air conditioning, or we're on boondocking and we can't. So what I found was this DeVault fan that works with the same pool power pack as the rest of my tools, and it plugs in. And this thing will actually run for about four days on the low setting. And it's very, very quiet on the low setting. And it's just enough air to be comfortable. Love my bow speaker. It's great for the for the new camp camper. Fits well right above the table. It links Bluetooth with my iPhone. I have Jackson Brown and all the latest pops on, on this Bose speaker. Fantastic for camping. Hi, my name is David Heisman and I live in Cornish, New Hampshire. And my special feature is a Wi-Fi amplifier booster that will take a signal from anyone who offers Wi-Fi at their site and will retransmit it with greater strength. So while here at the new camp uh, 19, I was able to cover a greater area where people could not get the signal from the initial site. I made it available at, with no password or anything. And if you're worried about passwords, you can add it. Uh, I got mine from technorv.com or you can get it from Amazon. I don't know about you, but I'm ready to go out and buy like half of those items. And if any of them caught your eye, please use the links in my blog, which support us through Amazon Associates. So here's to making your camping experience a little more comfy. Love and light. additions to your campsite, camping, camp supply repertoire. I don't want to make it sound stupid. To your camping pack list, to your campsite amenities, camp packing list, camping pack list, camping pack list. Okay.